Good morning. So we are heading out. This is the outfit for traveling. Breakfast time. Here we go. change clothes until we get home so we're gonna do a full day and then head home at 7 p.m tonight to do the day all over again here we go they put up their christmas trees november 1st escalators on the left side. Fast lane is right. stop where we're gonna eat lunch before our tour but look they have a little garden center so cute this is where we are going to be eating i think it has like ramen and chinese food maybe we'll eat ramen mm. So we have made it to the Metropolitan Outer Area Underground Discharge Channel Center and we're going to get a tour of it. It kind of looks like this, but we are going with like a ton of old people. So it's the, if they can do it, so can we. But here is where we're walking. I think we're going over there. That might be the entrance. Okay, here we go. This is the entrance. So it's 116 steps down.
over here and then it yeah, comes so, up into here. Right. The so this is the only shaft that's not connected to any rivers. Uh -huh. But these are the uh -huh. four. So all the overflow comes into these shafts. It goes through this tunnel, go, goes into number one. Uh -huh. And as the water rises, it comes through here. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So that's this number one here. And we see like the top one third. So oh. if you look down, it's still way... You know when, oh, the soap? How do they... The so Take it off. Okay, so they said either by yeah, hand no, or with a bowl. Right here. It opens up. Oh, so they gotta yeah. take it off. Oh. Yeah, so when the bulldozer comes through, um, all the debris and stuff goes up together from that area. That makes sense. Yeah. So, so and said that there was a pump that activates the water from the bubble so the Yes. So, so what they said was that hole is they use a crane to lower a bulldozer in here to drive around here and clean it. That's why I like all the black up there, they usually clean that off so that over here is all clean and then this is so that the bulldozer doesn't fall in the hole. That's what they said. So today is usually 40% humidity. Is usually more, they said during the summer, so the floor would be wet. Probably like that over there. But because today is getting cooler, it's 40%. So this water, let me look at the pamphlet again. This area gets pumped into the Edogawa River by Tokyo Bay. So this is where if Tokyo floods, all the water comes through here and it gets pumped out so that Tokyo doesn't flood. So we cannot pass here, but we can look. She was saying that this is just, you can see just the top third of the column that goes into the river and look at all the dirt and stuff that goes down I guess it's to keep people from falling in too yeah how tall is this thing again? 70 meters is the pillar 70 meters tall 2 meters wide and how many? 7? 2 7 7, seven, seven meters zero. wide these are the stairs we came down and there's 116 stairs we went down into here. So this whole place is 18 meters high, 177 meters long, 100, uh, no, no, 78 meters wide, and then nine, 18 meters tall. And then it holds how much water? It holds 59 concrete pillars. Each of them 2 meters wide, 18 high, weighing approximately 500 tons. So we're heading back up now. I'm going to time lapse it. Whoa, look at that line. So this is where they drop the bulldozer in when they clean it and all under here is the big thing we're in. Oh, breath is breathing a little harder. But the area is really nice. I think this is a soccer field. So this is what it looks like from above. We entered right here. Right now we are standing here. This is what it looks like. And then this thing was the thing we were looking at. The view of everything. Okay.
this way. Mm, most of it. So we just got to the airport and we are going to be, I think, getting to the area where our bags are to pick them up to check in. Oh, I think it's right over there. He set all of our bags up. Each person has a trolley. So cool. Okay, I think we're gonna check in now. Oh, I forgot how big this place is. We're going to Q. Oh my god, it has the whole alphabet. We have finally made it into the airport. It is like probably five o'clock. Okay, I'm looking for a place to eat because we're gonna have to get food before we get on the plane. Oh, we have food. So now there's this new tax-free souvenir area you can go there's a lot of stuff So we've made it to our gate and these are my faces. Like this. Cool. I got egg. Look at all the political ads from what you so we have it's time to board. Let me grab all my things. So many treasures. Let's go. bus has arrived.
I'm going to take a shower because we are living November 2nd, two days, because I did full November 2nd in Japan, and then at 7 p.m. we flew home, and 7 a.m. we arrived November 2nd again. But I've got all my stuff, all this, that I have to put away. And that's the end of the video. Thank <laughs> you.